Yo, what's going on? We, and by we, I mean I, but I guess you guys are coming with me too. We are going to the UK for a week because RuneFest is on Friday and Saturday, which is October 4th and 5th. Uh, it's currently Tuesday, October 1st right now, and the flight leaves in like five hours. It takes off at 5 p.m. and it's currently just past noon right now. So I've been packing the last few days and we're almost done at this point, almost done packing now. So there's my suitcase. You can see like all my random stuff in there. I decided to put my skateboard in there. I probably won't get the chance to use it because it looks like it's going to be raining like pretty much every day that we're there. But it can't hurt to bring it because I have uh, extra weight available to me to put in my suitcase and got space for it. So may as well, right? Use this thing for a while, but it's very nice that I still have it because I will be trying to use it to edit these IRL videos and maybe AFK a bit of RuneScape on the side. This is probably one of the most important things right here. This is like a battery pack or a power supply, whatever you want to call it. Uh, it's Anchor brand, would highly recommend. This is not sponsored. I wish it was because they're freaking amazing. I got this thing a few years ago and it's so, so good to have. I've used it for so many different things like walking around the city, waiting in airports, going camping or hiking, and just like anytime you're gonna be away from an outlet for a while, this is really, really good to have. Like charge your phone or charge whatever so many times with this thing. I think it cost me like 40 bucks or something, but it's so worth it. So yeah, I'm gonna be staying in the UK for a week. Uh, I'm staying with three other people. So there's Orion, who's a guy from uh, my stream chat. I've known him for a couple of years. And then there's the YouTuber Nine Rain and the other YouTuber Colinello. I'm sure uh, a lot of you may know at least one or the other of them. Bro, dude, freaking Orion and Nello are so tall though. I'm gonna look so small compared to them. Then uh, Nine Rain's like average height, but dude, it's, it's gonna be so bad. Once you see them, you'll see what I'm talking about. I know this is gonna come around in the comments, so I'll just address it now. Um, last year I stayed with Evie, Link, and Rarg, so when they announced the RuneFest dates this year, I asked them what they were doing, and they said they already got an Airbnb together. So I asked why I wasn't invited, and they said because they just genuinely thought I was busy. And I know Evie, he's not one to beat around the bush with things, he's always straight up, so. There is genuinely no animosity or hatred between any of us. I know all you freaking internet people love drama, but there's none here, sorry. And here I have the breakfast of champions. An apple. You know what'd be really good on this would be like honey or something. I've heard a lot of people talk about all the items that we'll need for RuneFest. Apparently there's a very important item that a lot of people should get, uh, this thing, and apparently the proper use for RuneFest is that. By the way, for those of you that don't know, uh, Jackson and I, or Colinello, as you probably know him, uh, we live in the same city, so we booked the same flight together, and I'll be meeting him at the airport at some point. I don't know where in the airport, but we will be meeting up. We got like an hour left before we leave, though, so I'm going to finish packing and see you probably at the airport. Apparently, uh, Nello will be here in like half an hour, so I'm going to go through security and wait at the gate for him. All right, we're here now. We're waiting for the plane. There's Nello, IRL, if you've never seen him before. Oh, I have an infernal case. <laughs> <laughs> he's always got to tell everyone. But yeah, the first flight's like an hour flight to Phoenix. And then from there, it's like an hour and a half layover. And then London. Okay, we made it to Phoenix. And it's dark out now. And we got like a 10 hour flight ahead of us. With uh, an hour until that flight, so. Need some content for the video. So we decided we're making a second video called Thieving and Training Slayer <laughs> IRL at the airport. Gone wrong, gone sexual, gone right, gone pulled. Not quite fitting. Yeah, exactly. Every time I go to the airport, the gate I have to go to is always the last one, B25. So once again, it's the last one. <laughs> there it is, all the way to the end. Mod Mark Donald had a farm. E O E O C. Okay, I don't know if you can hear me, if this thing's working, but on the plane, I was playing Pokemon. Well, me and uh, Jackson were both playing Pokemon, just trying to see how far we can make it. Of course, you know, I got that mud kit. Okay, we've made it to the UK now after 10 hours of flying. We're here, we're gonna claim our luggage, meet up. I don't know if Nine Rain and uh, Orion are here waiting for us or not. They made it sound like they were, but we'll see if we're gonna see them at the airport. And uh, yeah, Nello was really excited. He was clapping when the plane landed and everything. <laughs> it's 1.30 p.m. here, which is uh, 5.30 a.m. for us. All right, we're at the airport now with the boys. There's Orion, super tall, even <laughs> taller than Nello, and then oh Nine Rain. I, I'm taller than I look in the shot, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just... Orion makes everyone look really short. Um, but yeah, we're waiting for the Uber now to get to the apartment. Hey, I'm doing a, a uh, house tour right now. So there's the door we come in, it's the oh, closet. Shit, dog. Who? 
Okay, now we're at the apartment and I'm going to switch the camera around because I can't do it while I'm recording and we'll take a look at what the whole place looks like. It's the door where you come in and then right next to it, stop laughing at me. The, pe the people want to see this kind of stuff. Okay, so here's uh, Orion and Nello's room and they have their own separate bathroom right over here. They actually had to move us apartments because the first one uh, had one bed in each room, but it was like one queen bed or something, or one bigger bed. And then this is what the bathroom looks like. It's a very nice bathroom. The light's on apparently. We're afraid of the dark. And then over here is me and Nine Rain's bedroom. We might uh, push these beds a bit closer so we can get really close at night. You know what I'm saying, boys? And then here's where all the fun happens. This is where the, the whole gang is right now. We got Chip, Penny, and used napkin. Uh, hey. <laughs> you just uh, usually sit like that? Yeah, this is uh, <laughs> pretty comfy for me, considering I've been on a play for a while, you know, yeah. I thought we'd air it out. I'm just watching the new Cold Nello video. <laughs> it was a good video. OSR's host of Breaking Is that that P-Mod guy? Uh, Holy shit. With the Infernal Cave? Me? Because who doesn't love a good beer after staying up for 30 hours? There's a playground. Up with the playground so you can drink while your kids uh, entertain themselves. I put money down that we're gonna see fucking Orion on that thing before the day's over. Orion's over here on his free-to-play UIM. Going for 70 crafting like a freaking mad lad. And Nello is having his first ever cider. Because in the UK, he's of legal age to drink, since he's only 20 in America. And well, 20, 20 here too, but he's, yeah, it's not illegal here. As per tradition, the fish and chips, the classic. Every time I eat this, it, it's so good but so bad because whenever I finish eating it, I never want to eat it ever again. Yeah, my name is Mudkip. I got real yeah, that, that's me. Everyone. Okay, well, we just left now, and as soon as we started walking, I realized I really got a poop now. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, whenever I eat the fish and chips, I always say never again, and now here we are. Once again, I'm saying never again, but tomorrow I guarantee I'll, I'll feel like eating it again. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna. Oh, this is such a bad angle. I'm not. <laughs> I'm choking on my spit. Oh, this is me lying down no, the bed. It's not, it not a very good flattering angle. All right. <clears throat> we've all been a wait. on your penis. <laughs> oh, no. All right, we've all been awake for like 30 hours now. We're all exhausted. Before we go, though, I want to give a, a shout out to Nine Rain and his very special account that he has uh, on his uh, One Kick Rick series, which you may have heard of. Uh, he, he actually died on his hardcore, and they rolled the servers back for that one Tipo. Fuck, it's not Tebow. <laughs> he died on his hardcore and they rolled the servers back for that Tebow glitch and he actually got his hardcore stats back. So One Kick Rick may be the only hardcore to have ever gotten their stats back. He's not on the high scores anymore. It's crossed off, but he's on there still. So check out, I'll put it in the description, episode four of One Kick Rick. Um, but yeah, tomorrow, uh, there's like a whole content creator meetup, supposedly, so we're gonna probably go to that. I probably won't be recording anything there, though, because that'd be really awkward meeting people, just like shoving the camera in their face, saying, hey man, big fan, by the way, so, really pro probably, probably, uh, well, okay, we're friends, though, right? Big fan. <laughs> I'm big monkey fan. Um, fuck, I'm just like rambling now, I don't know. So yeah, I guess I'll just see you back tomorrow with uh, some more England stuff and we're going to drift off into unconsciousness. Goodbye.